earth. You see, this is a new thing in the earth. A woman shall surpass a man, meaning a woman shall be over the man. All right? And through this feminism BS, all right, these women, are, uh, you know, make themselves equal with a man, you know, put themselves over the man, tell the man what he can and what he can't do, you know? But all of that's coming to an end, man. Okay? You women are going to learn to play your role, man. All right? Let me get this. Okay? Because this so-called feminist nonsense is of the world, man. All right? And the spirit of Yahweh Shema Washah is destroying it. Let me get this, too. Okay? Job 39 and 17, and it reads, it says, Because Yahweh Shema Washah have deprived her of wisdom, all right? That her going back to these women. Because Yahweh Shema Washah have deprived her of wisdom, neither have he imparted to her understanding. You see that? So these women don't get it. Because the so-called wisdom they have is the wisdom of the world. And the scriptures say that the wisdom of this world is foolishness with the most high, man. Okay? Dealing with this feminist nonsense, man. All right? Let's grab this. Okay? First Timothy. Okay? First, First Timothy chapter 2 and 11. We'll start there. 1 Timothy 2 and 11, it says, let the woman learn in silence, okay? Let the woman learn in silence with all subjection. Verse 12, but I suffer not a woman to teach, okay? And that's the point, man. The scriptures say I suffer not a woman to teach, man. And you got, you got Israelite women all over the, all over the YouTube teaching, so-called breaking down the scriptures, coming on the comment board, trying to teach us, trying to teach the men of the Lord. All right, you going way the hell off. But I suffer a but I suffer not a woman to teach, nor to usurp authority over the man, but to be in silence, man. All right, and you women love to to, to, to skip and hop over the scripture and twist it up. It says what it says, man. What's so hard about that, man? But I suffer not a woman to teach, nor to usurp authority over the man, but to be in silence. Hey, just shut your ass up. Just be quiet. Verse thirteen. For Adam was first formed, then Eve. It says, and Adam was not deceived, but the woman being deceived was in the transgression. All right? The woman was the one that, that, that was uh, uh, deceived, man. You know? Let's add on. 1 Corinthians chapter 14, verse 33. 1 Corinthians chapter 14, verse 33, and it reads, it says, For Yahweh Shemel Shai is not the author of confusion. Okay? And this is exactly what you women have been bringing, confusion.